Blaney, thank you very much. A lot of people are hearing these weather warnings. We've been talking about them for several days now and changing up their Halloween plans. Our Steve King spent the afternoon at a popular trick or treat spot in Winston Salem before things got really bad. He has a look now at some of the changes that neighbors are making on this Halloween. This house here in the Ardmore neighborhood gets pretty busy on Halloween night, as you can probably tell by the decorations. But the homeowners this year are asking all trick or treaters to come tomorrow. If someone comes and beats on the door, then we'll gladly give them a treat, but we're not going to be operational. Uh, don't plan on having any lighting on, no animatronics running, just simply because of the weather. It's too dangerous for all the stuff. It's too dangerous for us. It's too dangerous for people to be out in it. Field says he's been preparing all month long for Thursday night, but he understands that safety comes first. It's a shame not to be able to enjoy all this with everybody. We work very hard to share with everybody and we just can't do it in this kind of weather. So we want to share it tomorrow night when it's going to be nice. I love celebrating, but I'm actually a pediatric nurse first and foremost. So I just want to remind families to play it safe. If it is very windy and there is lightning, I don't recommend them to really come out here. Other Ardmore Halloween fanatics are urging people to stay safe, even if that means staying in tonight. Now for anyone planning to do trick or treating this evening, emergency management leaders ask that you at least wear reflective clothing so that drivers can see you at all times. Reporting in Winston-Salem, Steve King, WXII 12 News. Thank you, Steve. Some small towns are postponing Halloween events. The Lexington Boo Bash, the Dobson Spooktacular, and downtown trick-or-treating events in Mount Airy and King are going to be Friday night instead of tonight. Leaders in Kernersville have also canceled a trick-or-treating event. Sadly, that one will not be rescheduled.